Hey, what's going on everyone? This is our reviews. In this video, I will show you guys the part 30 of the top 10 city tweaks compatible with iOS 10 up to iOS 10.2. So this is the part 30. When I started this series on part one, I told you it will go to, to part 30 or more. And here we are, part 30 of the top 10 city tweaks compatible with iOS 10 up to iOS 10.2 open on search this is a very useful tweak when you search for an app on the spotlight search it will automatically open it when you type when you tap search so if i search for cydia right here you can see this second i tap search here it will open cydia so you can see automatically opens the cydia app april fools this is a tweak for April Fools, if you want to prank your friends, you go ahead and install this tweak on their devices and here's what it does. You install it and anytime you press a key on your keyboard, it will, it will enter like random words here, random sentences. You can see what it does, like you just enter a number or a letter, whatever you want, it will just type here this stuff. So to install this tweak, you will need to add a repo, which you will find in the description. Quick Dial Pro. This tweak allows you to quickly call numbers from the phone dialer here. You can press and hold a number and then it will show you that contact. You can call message or you can FaceTime him to so just tap here to call or to FaceTime or the message. Now to enter the numbers you will need to go to the settings of this tweak and here you have the numbers from 1 to 9 and the zero number. So you go here and enter any phone number that you want. Enhanced Switcher Close. This tweak will enhance the app switcher of your iOS 10 device. So at an app card right here, if you swipe like this, you can relaunch the app or if you want to close it, you can swipe all the way up and it will close the app. On the home card, you can swipe like this to relaunch all apps. If you swipe again once more, you can kill all the apps or if you swipe even further, you can respring your device. Horseshoe. Now this is actually a very famous tweak for iOS 10 for the control center of the iOS 10 devices and I don't know why I haven't put it on my top 10 videos yet. That's really stupid but anyway better late than never. So what it does is that actually it combines two pages of the control center into one. So you will have your toggles here, your controls as well as your quick launches. And you can see here you can have the volume or the brightness you just tap here to change the slider to change the effect of the sliders to the volume or to the brightness and if you want to configure it if you want to change the configuration you just swipe like that and it will show you the configuration here and you can rearrange the sections of the control center countdown this tweak allows you to set a reminder for an event right here on the lock screen instead of the press to unlock you can have a reminder for your event so it shows you how many days you have left until your event so if you jump to the settings of this tweak what you have here is an enable button here you can set the name of the event and also the date and then you have the countdown format and here you can choose between four different formats to install it you will need to add a repo which you can find in the description mini hood this tweak allows you to change the size of the volume hood on your device you can see how small the volume hood of my device is and you can change that to three different sizes so you enable it right here and then you have small normal which this which is the stock of ios and then big if you want to have a bigger volume hood no updates available what this tweak does is that it removes the list of apps that you have already updated so when you go to the app store here you will see a list of all the apps that you have already updated if you don't have any new updates this tweak will show you all apps are today up to date and won't show you the list of the apps ring ui this tweak will change the look of certain parts of ios to squares now normally these right here will have rounded corners the search bar and also the widgets and it will change them to squares it will do the same with the folder icons right here you can see also the dots also the control center it will also apply to the press passcode buttons and a lot of stuff on the device on the ios 10 devices will be squared instead of circles using ring ui Dividers away. This is a simple tweak. All it does is that it removes the dividers from table views like this on the settings. So you can see here no dividers at all between the rows and you will have this effect on many of the stock apps of iOS 
where there are dividers, this tweak will remove them. The tweak doesn't have any options to configure. So that is it for this video guys, I hope you guys enjoyed it, for more videos like this make sure to subscribe, also go ahead and follow me on my social media, you will find all the links in the description of this video.